change power settings on advanced uh, power settings sleep okay if you see the <coughs> hybrid sleep is uh, disabled and uh, you want to turn that on because this is windows default it's uh, disabled by default so you want to have this on to be able to uh, stop the battery drain when the laptop is off so let's turn it on okay i'll show you how to do it um close that we're gonna find the command cmd run it type this in Okay, so this is going to give us a uh, system power report, and I'm going to show you how that it's actually fixed the problem. So click on that. Okay, the report's been generated. So we open that location there. Okay, system 32. Okay, it's already there. If it's not there, all you got to do is click this. Click this date modified, and should come up at the top. Okay, let's look at the shutdowns. As you can see, when I fixed it up, my shutdown has been 37 hours and there wasn't any battery drain at all. I can prove this to you. Okay, so ignore this one and this one. That one is actually my battery capacity. So what you want to look at is the first one. When we started to sleep, this one here, that's the battery capacity and when I turn the computer back on or we uh, finish the sleep it's the same capacity you know so it's actually been fixed now you know and uh, let me show you how to turn on the hybrid sleep now close that so to be able to turn on hybrid sleep <coughs> I'm gonna type this in A. This is going to give us now all the sleep states available on the PC. Okay. So if you can, if you can see here, so far I haven't got hybrid sleep. Only got standby S3 and fast startup enable on this PC. And to enable um, hybrid sleep, uh, Windows by default is got a small size small size file for um, for hybrid file hybrid file is small size so what you need to do you actually need to uh, make the hybrid file full size okay so if we type this in here again uh, question page okay so this are, these are the example what we can do here, you know. If you type this in, power CFG, you can turn it off, hibernate, or you can set the particular size you want. Do you want to set it 100% the size of your memory? Or you want to type it reduced or maybe full, you know. And at the moment, uh, it's reduced. So I can show you that in uh, uh, this one here, open a uh, registry. And if you look at here, hybrid, hybrid file type is number one. That means it's reduced. And that means hybrid sleep is not going to work. So we have to change this one to two, but not here. We're going to do it over here. Um, type this in. H. Type. And we want full size for the for the hybrid uh, file full and now it's been changed it's gone bigger okay so if we go back here look at the numbers the number has just changed okay hybrid file type it's changed to number two 
So now we got bigger, uh, harder file, and now the sleep should be enabled. If you look at it in the power settings, okay. We look up there. Sleep, and it's on. Okay, and that's all you need to do. But keep in mind, if you got uh, if you got Intel laptop. Uh, you might have to go into BIOS and you have to go into BIOS and you have to disable Intel uh, virtualization Okay, otherwise it's not going to work So this is AMD laptop and uh, I don't have to do anything in BIOS But I'm just telling you guys who, who have, if you got uh, Intel uh, Intel PC You have to go into BIOS and you have to actually disable the Intel virtualization and then do all these steps that I show you now and then uh, the problem is going to be fixed. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.